Hello everyone, I'm Polish Lover Mocha Lover, and thank you for joining me here, of course, in Hearts of Iron 4, playing with the History Lies in Our Hands mod. Now, right now it's 1944. This is way after, technically in years, where I left you guys off, and this is Europe at this point. So, last time, at the end of last episode, America joined the Allies, right? They joined the Allies, and, you know, we were thinking, that might be a little crazy. Also, we do have a new faction called New Europe. I haven't done a lot of the cool uh, focuses either, like... Gates of Europe, I've left that, and, like, undone until I, I started re-recording this, or, you know, recording again. I've done a lot of the fo Navy focus tree, or part of the focus tree, focus branch, as well as the air stuff. Uh, what is this? Oh, boy. Ooh, exists. Current rule playing. I'll talk about that in a little bit. And I've been doing all the generic focus tree for Poland, or, you know... Poland's normal focus tree. But anyways, so here's what happened. So America joined the war. And then all of a sudden, the Allies, last time, they had like 20 divisions here. And then they pulled out. As soon as America joined, they pulled out. I don't know why. They pulled out. So I'm like, okay, take out Denmark then. Take out Sweden. Take out Norway. Take out Finland. But take out Norway because that's how I launched a naval invasion into the UK or the British Empire. Uh, this is the United Kingdom. So yeah, in this campaign, it's the United Kingdom. I invaded from Norway using some... Motorized boys. And these guys actually have a little bit of mechanized infantry on them as well. And logistic companies. I also threw some infantry, infantry over here. General TM. Cool. And actually, they were giving me so much trouble right here. Actually, let's double check. They have a lot of air power. And I don't have... You know, I've got air superiority around here. Not England at all, though. And Wales and Cornwall, whatever. But then I... You know, we were struggling up there. And I figured, you know what? How about I send some really, really... Heavy tanks. Not super heavy, it's just normal heavy tanks. And this is my template, super heavy tanks with mechanized infantry. And I'm trying to throw some infantry here too. Uh, also, at the end of the last episode, or no, when I was going to start recording this again, the Soviets flipped to the Russian Federation because they have communism defeated. No, Polish diversion. Uh, it was uh, a focus here, I believe. Yeah, there it is. Polish comics. Because we have Polish comics, the fascism goes down, communism goes down, so I guess democracy just kind of won out. Kind of crazy. Regardless, this is the world. Now, you might be wondering, why have I not taken out the Comintern yet? It's 1944, they're going to build themselves up to be extremely strong. They've taken out most of China, or they have most of China with them. India, Northern Africa. The reason for that is because I want to see the Comintern as kind of like a final boss force. A major European-Asian conflict. I think that would be awesome. Really laggy, probably, but really awesome. So that's why I kind of did it like this. And they still have a good chunk of Western Europe, most of Italy, France, Iberia. So that is the world that we currently have. I do apologize. I know you guys, some of you guys don't like it when I, you know, record a lot off screen, but it's better to do it like this than to have like 10 episodes of me playing for half an hour where you might see like three months to four or five, six months of really not much happening. And I don't have time for that. I really don't have time to make 30 episode long, or 30 episode long campaigns, yeah. Just, that would be very cool. But anyways, we're at war, and I'm trying to throw more guys in here without ruining my supply. So, and you guys go ahead and lower yourselves to balanced. We only have so many guys here, so. That's good, and actually, I was thinking, you know what? Since you guys are up here, and since they're distracted down south, I'm going to go ahead and start sandwiching them right here. We should be able to do okay in these together, 40 combat with, even though they probably have air superiority here still. 300 ground mission bombers, planes. Oh, I stopped bombing. I stopped using my air force just because they were bombing my guys so ridiculously hard. It was insane how hard they were bombing my guys. So I'm going to send you here, you here, and then you guys here. Uh, yeah, definitely... Put them on these guys. These motorized divisions that we have, too. I only took these guys off the line because supply was getting so bad. Uh, at this point, you know what? You might as well do that as well. Dig straight on in. Alright, you guys, stop attacking. Hold, for the love of God. Hold. You're suffering from attrition as well. Oh, you were immediately defeated. That's not good. Alright, so somehow they're defeating us immediately because they can pierce my tanks. Holy cow. Gonna hold for now. Just take hold on to Dover. Yeah, they can. They can. Oh, this is not good. If that's the case, we're gonna swarm from the north. This is merely a distraction. 
If this is the case, I'm going to go ahead and pull my tanks out. Because there's so much supply being sucked in here that you guys need to go home. And so I'm going to shut down, whatever. Leave, leave, leave. If you can. So the supply isn't super bad around here. There you go. Now I'll send everyone in the north from Scotland to kill them all off in northern England. There you go. Works out like that. Cool. And I've been seeing a lot of enemy ships, which is really cool. Um, yeah. It's okay. And we're probably going to lose this area, Dover. Yeah, probably going to lose it. Give me two divisions. Can you guys actually be stay here? Oh, they might not. They might. They might lose. I might lose Dover, but that's a good. That was a really good distraction for us in the north here. That was actually really, really good. Uh, 1943. I still haven't done a lot of the stuff. Land night attack, I suppose. Sure, why not? They pushed me out, so be it. It's worth the losses. Hey, look, part of the fleet sunk. Up, oh, and we lost those divisions. Unfortunate, I know. That's alright, though. It bought us a lot of time to just swarm down here. Good. Swarm, 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 swarm. Also, I did raise my conscription level. Another battleship. Look at that. Nice. Um, where are we? Service by requirement. Kind of had to do that. Industrial concerns. You might as well do that, too. Good. Taking a lot more of their territory. Very good. Do a hull. Liverpool. Be good. Keep sinking a lot of their stuff. Oh. Nice. Convoys and stuff like that. Oh, at this point we might need to slow down our attacks. Well, I'm glad my tanks didn't get destroyed, which is, you know, really good. Just make sure the tanks aren't destroyed and we'll be okay. Destroyers, you guys. Very good. Just keep it up with whatever you're doing, except maybe... Well, can't really fix that too much. Push those... Is that Mexican division? Or maybe... No, that's not Italian. It's not, not Mexican. Cool, cool. Oh, man. If you guys could continue attacking, that would be awesome. I don't know if you can, though. Coast Guard's coming in again. Awesome, awesome. Throw some more guys in there. Take that radar station away so they don't have it. The UK. Let's look at casualty. So, almost 3 million for the UK. About halfway to capitulating. I've suffered half a million so far. The Comintern's lost two... Oh, four and a half. America has lost almost 3 million guys, though. That's not bad. That's pretty good for us. Come on. Manchester. We might make a new port here, just in case. Peloponnese, sure, do that. Do that. Uh, I can make some nuclear reactors, which would be cool. And it could maybe use... Well, actually, we're okay with supplies. Let's go make another nuclear reactor, then. Uh, where shall we make it? Right here. Burgos. Good stuff. Take the radar. So they, good. So they, they don't have it. Radar is for the poles. Now, I could have, I guess, I could have broken their cipher. I might, well, do we even have it? We do have it ready and available. Should have done that actually when I was attacking. Forgot about that. Whoopsie. Oh, well. You guys are doing okay. We'll find a way to break through these guys. Like right here. Hopefully we can break through right here. Destroy two more divisions. It looks like we're getting invaded here, which is not ideal. America's invading to the north. Come on, guys. Hurry up. Take them out. Take them out. Because we're going to send some divisions up north. Come on. Get in there. Come on. And then immediately attack here. Good. Awesome. Now, I'm going to pull up the motorized because we're getting invaded right here. God dang. Wait, you, oh, God, they actually pushed through there. That's not good. Uh, let's see. 
You know what? They want to do like that. I'm sure I have enough naval bombers. I've made a lot of naval bombers. Give me 800. Bomb the living hell out of the uh, convoys and stuff like that. Oh, right there. We got any other fighters? 200. Two. Fighter twos. Do that. Do not let them get. Do not let us get cut off. That would be so bad right now. Oh, I'm going to Luxembourg. Cool. Pull the tanks back up there. That's important. Uh, yeah. I don't think Luxembourg is going to be much of a challenge for us. I just want to clear them out of the way. There you go. They join the Allies, and no one cares. Let's go ahead and justify on Sweden. Sweden? No, Sweden's gone. Switzerland. Look at that. Alright, America, you want to do that like that? Yeah. No supplies. Very good, very good. No, 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 no. Ah, there goes Luxembourg. Great news. God dang it. You know what? Hmm. Don't lose Edinburgh. And expand Central Industrial Region. Let's give develop Upper Silesia. Upper Silesia has been contested since the Great War. Developing the region will, be, will unite the people of the area and improve our industry for a whole civilian factory. A whole factory. You gotta do that. You just help them out here. That's not good either. But at least they're starving for supplies. And they're really starving for supplies up there. Ah, oh, good. American convoy is going bye-bye. Good. Air skirmish. Nice 500 air XP. Let's grab some bomber defense. Awesome. They're, they're going to die now. 100% going to die. Uh, well, as long as they don't get a port up here, we'll be okay. They're going to probably take an air base. Go ahead and come up here. Ooh, what's going on right here? Can I hit our subs? No, no, no. Look at all these convoys going bye-bye. Alright. I'd like to unleash another attack, but I'm going to wait till I get my tanks down here first. Good. I'm going to concentrate our guys right here. And you guys might be... Ah, uh, you might actually be able to win and take that airfield. Great. The more airfields we take, the less that they have. Destroyers. Very good. Very good. Alright, you guys. Finish these guys off. No worries. Oh. Some more convoys. Going on. More convoys sunk. Good. 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 And that's taken care of. Awesome. Tanks are down here. And I'm going to have them push as hard as they possibly can. This is going to be the end of the UK in this final push. In three, two, good enough for me. Paused. And we're going to use our ciphers. Oh, Peter, hello. Hope you're having a good day. Immediately push. 50% more breakthrough is a godsend. So much more breakthrough. I love it. There's sub options. Good, good. We're using some subs. But I do have a normal task force fleet, which I should show you right now. So, I've got two task force fleets with one battleship each and four light cruisers. Not a lot, but it is at least a little something. I want to make sure that we have an extra thing guarding those guys. Let's see, two at a time. Keep making more. I'll make another heavy capital ship. What? Make another one of these too. We've got the dockyards for itself. So. And everyone comes to Königsberg. Even though it might be called something different in Polish. Hmm. I don't know. Nice. Not bad, not bad. Wales has been fully... Oh, at least this portion of Wales has been fully cut off. Very good. And I do have a thing of Polish green tea here. Not coffee. Hmm, weird. What is that? Broken... Ah, yeah. Broken enemy ciphers. Good stuff. 
Ah, Cardiff has been cut off. Yes. Cardiff? Cardiff? Something like that. Convoys sunk all around. Before they capitulate, soonish. They have about a million manpower, 1.77 million. Lots of factories, tons of fuel. That's an insane amount of fuel. Uh, Army-wise, 41 divisions. Over 200 ships. And a total of 3,000 planes deployed. Not bad. That's pretty good. That's not too bad. Oh, look at that. That's beautiful. Oh, yeah. That's so good. Keep it up, guys. I know I sh really shouldn't be attacking with infantry. Uh, but you know what? Whatever. You guys come on down south here. Help take out this area. And I will make these guys mechanize. Our winged hussars will be mechanized before we're done here. Now, we're not suffering from any so, so, any sort of resource deficit, which is muy bueno. Let's see. What else can we throw on here? Motorized. We have plenty enough motorized. I have a very good amount of tanks. Mechanized is looking really good. Fighters are looking good. Naval bombers are looking good. We're looking really good. You know, I'll even make some anti-air because because we can. There you go. Happy 1945. It's weird that Poland is still leading the war in 1945 against the Allies. But, like I said, I want the commentary to be like the final boss of the Russian Federation that kicked out a lot of the Allies. So, I'm probably going to go to Iceland, Denmark, invade North America through Canada, which is going to take some time. Be kind of annoying. Whatever. And take out America that way. Have a peace deal. Set up a cold war between the Central European or Empire and Russia. That's the plan. Ah, very good. Cornwall. Ah, London has fallen. Very nice. Very good. Very good. Ah, the UK has capitulated. Great news. Great, great news. Finally, that, that took honestly that took a long time. Eh, not a long time, but it took a while though. I had to make sure I had invaded from Norway instead of invading through the English town because they've just had so many planes down here. That's so good that they're gone now, finally. And, of course, next I want to invade Belfast. Now I'm going to move you guys. Instead of over here, you are all going to come to Glasgow. No, Lenark. And we're probably going to invade with infantry guys again. Go ahead and plan the naval invasion. Of Belfast, Liverpool, that'll be good. Take everything around Belfast first, that'd be awesome. Keep navally bombing them, they need it, they deserve it. We'll go to war with Ireland as well. Something like that. And then you guys... I don't know if there'll be enough time for us to actually invade through there. So come down there. That'd be good. Oh, American Battleship. Nice. Very good. Very good. Very good. And I still need to invade the Alan, Alan Islands, or however you pronounce that. I was thinking about taking out Turkey, too. But that would open up a massive front against the Comintern, which might be okay. Oh! The Allies are blue now because of America. How lovely. And we do need to... Oh, Ice... Oh, no. I have to wait so long to invade Iceland. I'm trying to justify on the Swiss. It's okay. Go ahead and do that for now. This campaign is going to last probably until 1950 for me to take out the Comintern as well. Or maybe we just avoid Iceland just take out Greenland. That's also a thought. Cool. Ah, my battleships. I love them. Panama's been called in. Let's get Logistics 3. That'll be good. Alright, are we ready to go yet? Not quite. Soon enough, though. There's only a few American divisions here. They're probably pretty tanky. That's okay. Let's make sure we got enough coverage everywhere. We have enough military factories. We're feeling pretty good. I'm going to start making a lot more of these... Uh, things. Infrastructure. Yeah, infrastructure. That, they have a name. Maybe a little bit more fuel, too. Fuel's always good to make. Always. Dockyards, of course, are good. You know what? I'm going to make some more dockyards, too, because why not? I love the dockyards. For some reason, it keeps putting it down south. I don't know why. Oops. And there we go. 
Another American battleship. Uh, they have a couple planes. I can't really do much. They have a couple planes over in northern Scotland, which is interesting. You guys, stop doing that. Alright. And we shall go very, very soon. Do that. That will be very, very good. And they should be off very soon. Well, hmm, Western approaches, huh? Uh, do they not have? There, the, there they go. Yeah, for some reason they weren't going. Hmm, whatever. Cool. We immediately get. Oh, we immediately bomb an American carrier. Okay, nice. We, I mean, eight hundred you know, naval bombers. That'll do it to them. We've landed. Take the air base so they have no air superiority. Immediately help attacking. Attack them, so. Take the airbase, and they've got nothing. Come on. I might not be able to take Belfast right now, though. Which is, would be an insanely bad thing. I don't know why there's still glitch like this. There you go. Come on, take the flipping airbase. Take it. Come on, move, move, move. We need tanks for this. So I'm going to send half of you guys to come from here, invade Belfast. And I didn't realize, but actually, you guys also come from Liverpool. Can you invade Dublin? That'd be nice. That'd be very nice, actually. Good. We took the air base. No more air for you. And these guys are should actually be technically cut off, maybe? No? Yes? Oh, this is not good. Good help support the attack there. Good, we got a little forts here. That's awesome. Develop Upper Silesia. Good. Um, <clears throat> two more divisions. Good, 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 good. Next up. Let's do cruiser tank experiments. So, with the basics of tank design in place, we are now ready to start forging our own path in a tangled field of mechanized design. Very good. Completely encircle Belfast. And how long will it... Oh, do not leave. Do not leave. How long will it take for us to build these ports? East Midlands. Oh, it's going to take a march... Oh, my goodness. We're probably not going to make it. I need the tanks to move as soon as they can. We have no supply here. Real bad. Oh, Sweden. Or Sweden. I keep saying Sweden. Switzerland and a Bavarian Union. Cool. And they're, are they off? Oh, some of the tanks might be going. Can we take Dublin? We might just be able to. Maybe. Oh, look at that. Canada. You got like. Division's super weak there. That's good. Uh, if we need to, I'm going to go start decrypting Mexico. As well as America and Canada. All three important to take out. Good. Now, if we can, break through here. Leave the tank here. Support the attack. Support the attack. If we can break through here, that basically guarantees... Yep, we. it's done. Good. Very good. They're immediately getting attacked. we got a little bit of supply. Help attack here. You guys hold. Can you help attack here? You might be able to break... No, you might not still, huh? That would not be very good. Oh, wait. What the hell? Alright, that's not cool. So, you are going to come up here and take out that Irish division. How are they... Yeah, I mean, naval divisions kind of suck. Oh, we lost a convoy. That's not good. Uh oh. Ah, they got American subbies. American subbies, I see. I'll break them if you can. You got nowhere to go, America. You got nowhere to go. And they're, they're immediately attacking my tanks here. Oh, that's alright. As long as we can hold, we should still be able to take out Belfast. There's nowhere they can go. There's literally nowhere they can go, which is all very good. Good. 
Come on over here. Uh, no. Immediately start attacking these guys. Immediately help out as well. Everywhere else should be able to hold. Especially since we get more tanks in here. Can they pierce me? No. Again, that's a good thing. Alright. This. Uh, artillery. Weapons. I still got more weapon stuff we could do. Good. Tanks are all here. Kill them. Oh, wait. Hold on. They need orders to kill people. Blop. Good. The tank should take care of these Irish boys. Should be able to. Pretty easily. Nice. If we need to, we can send everyone this way. That'd be awesome. Angered by Swiss posturing. Very good. Very good. Oh. Awesome. Awesome. Yeah, I'll take a Switzerland next. Send all the special guys from there to do that. Sunk two American subs. Good. And Cork has fallen, and we shall have Ireland with us. Good. Delightful. Very nice. Now, let's go ahead and switch these guys to have more, 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 more mechanized, because I don't even need to look. I'm sure we've got enough. I've been producing a lot. Let's see. Mechanized. 3,600 pieces. Not bad. Pretty darn awesome. Now let's grab you guys. You can help surround these guys as well. And then you will do sort of the same thing. Now this time I'm going to switch you, switch it around. You all help invade. What you guys are going to do is come here and invade there. You guys come from here. Invade here. So we need one, probably two, three to get up to here. The only port though is right there, which is kind of a problem. I definitely have to take out Iceland first though, which is really quite a bummer. Quite the bummer. 1945, I've got a lot of this stuff researched already. Let's do more infantry stuff, such as improved infantry equipment three. That would be very good. Let's speed time up just a wee bit. Ooh. There's some, some American subs still around here. What a darn shame. Fighters are doing alright. Uh, you guys. I want to cut you guys down in half. Send half you guys to Ireland. Do western approaches. And then the rest of you guys do the North Sea or something like that. I put a lot of planes down here. Lots of planes. So give me half you guys. You seem to be doing okay. Half of that. I'm going to start plopping you onto different army groups. Such as... My motorized. Actually, that's a lot of guys. Not just on motorized. There you go. Nice. Very good. Very good. Ah, another carrier. Of all, all ships we could have sunk, the carrier was sunk. No Russian Federation. I really don't trust that. Battleships. Nice. Hmm. Very good. Very good. Let's see. Night vision. Great. Let's do that first. We're going to grab some more mechanized. Stronger, 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 stronger mechanized. Thick Hussars, fuel refining, very good. Actually, you know what, just do this. Mechanized, mechanized, mechanized. Tons of mechanized. It's almost a purely mechanized group. Actually, the armor isn't really good with mechanized one, but whatever. It's 1945, it doesn't matter. Better fuel refining, because we have a lot of mechanized, a lot of things. And you guys, you know what? Go ahead. Start sinking some stuff. Ooh. We still need that island, too. Where are you all at? I only need two divisions for this. Come from Liverpool to the Isle of Man. Yeah, this is looking pretty nice. We're going to have one massive front line against the Soviets. Or I guess they're not Soviets anymore. They are just Russians. With a lot of extra minorities, I guess, technically. Because Russian is probably the majority here. And then you got Ukrainians, you got some Be Belarusians, White Ruthenians, Kaiserreich, something like that. Probably a couple Finns, actually. Savo? No, sorry. No, that's normal. That's normal. Uh, you have some Kaz Kaz Kazakhstan people, and then you got some Armenians, some Azerbaijani people, some Georgians, 
Some good stuff. Logistics 3. Awesome. Uh, let's go down and do this. Import submarine technology. A submarine gap is unacceptable. We will have to, the technology even if we must purchase it. Very good. Very good. Logistics 3. Let's go to Logistics 4. I know I could be doing military police, but something tells me with military police right now, it won't matter too much. We're doing pretty darn well. So anyways, I'm going to end the, end the episode here. We just turned an enemy agent, which is really cool, but let's see. Let's, oh, we're not doing too much. I can get a couple more upgrades, like army department, but we're going to leave that here for now because I don't want this video to go on too long. So tomorrow, we just finished off the British Isles. I'm going to invade these islands, take them out, probably take out Switzerland, or Sweden, Switzerland, Switzerland as well, invade North America, and you will see me in North America probably struggling against Americans, Canadians, and the rest of the UK. Anyways, guys, hope you, if you enjoyed today's episode, consider leaving a like, subscribe if you're new, check my Discord link in the description below, and I will see you all tomorrow as we have a good time in North America. Thanks for watching, have a great rest of your day.